Hello, Arkminner here, and welcome to the show. So, I didn't go to get any New York Comic Con goes <laughs> today. Eh, what is wrong with me? <laughs> oh, well. Shout outs, real quick. Three Geeks Network, make sure you check them guys out. Mike McGee. It looks like he's on a trip of some kind. Hmm. Interesting. Um, AMJ, a local YouTuber, actually ran into him today. And I gave him a hug because he's cool. <laughs> Great channel. Go check him out. And I guess he's moving. Going to school. California. Maybe he'll be a big movie producer. We'll find out. XDF for all the tablet stuff I'm currently not doing. I kind of just dabble right now. But it's cool to check in with me. Nerdbot Media for all the Nerdbot stuff. Make sure you check out the Nerdbot and Nerdbot Girls on Instagram and everything. Cosplay. Give your cosplay powers. Check him out. He's on Instagram. He'll give you your cosplay power. So my Mega Ega video is doing very well. Oh, and before we get any further, Arc Matter Channel is your only channel that's still brought to you on dial-up. <laughs> Was it a couple weeks ago I think I said something about um, basic. <laughs> basic. I'm your basic. Actually, I think, yeah, we'll go with that I'm your only local YouTuber that's still on dial-up. Okay, so why are we here? First of all, you heard me just crying a little bit. <laughs> that I forgot about the... I don't know how I forgot because I'm, I'm always on my Instagram looking at my social media. Just, I have a lot of things going on and I'm trying to... And this stuff's falling down in here. That I'm trying to work on in order to get ready for winter. Uh, and just, you know... Then I had Cincinnati, uh, the Comic-Con last week, and... This is where we're at now. I'm going to pick up a few New York uh, City Funkos. It's just not very many. Uh, I think I wanted the Boba Fett, the future Boba Fett. He looked pretty cool. And I want, I want to get the Darth Vader, too. That looks pretty neat. Uh, but I've, I've cut back quite a bit on my Funkos because it can get to your bank account after a while. And then I don't know where half these people keep their... I don't. I don't know where half these people keep their Funkos. I mean, I've already got... One day I'll have to do a video and show you. I mean, I've got... In the Arc Matter Cave, I've got most probably a good 30 or 50 in here, which you've seen in the, seen them in the videos when I've kind of scanned through them and, and shown you, along with my cosplay stuff and my 3D printing stuff and um, such. Uh, I have nothing against, I love, love Funkos, but I, I, but I love too much stuff. And then you get this insanely, or it's, everything's consuming uh, your your living space. And, and now that my kids are pretty much gone, uh, I don't want it to take up any more on any more space. <laughs> but I still do like it. So here we go. So I picked up I'm in uh, the other night because you know uh, Friday was Force Friday, triple 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 Force Friday. Da -da 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 -da. And so I picked up, and I just have to go into Walgreens because we were looking for the um, Nightmare Before Christmas uh, bags that we missed. And so I ran across this at Walgreens, which is the Spirit, ooh, the Spirit Ghost Rider, which is the Game of Verse thing. And then um, I went ahead and picked up, uh, of course, a Pop Tee, which is Star Wars, which has the VHS tape look, which I love these. These are so cool, but once again, if you get too many, they take up space. Funko, please help make stuff that's flat. Can we have flat Funkos? And then, uh, and like, we can set them up flat against each other like cards. <laughs> so I got this. It, it was a must. The Star Wars shirt. I, I haven't even opened it yet. I'm going to open it here in a minute, and we'll take a look at it together. But that was the triple, 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 triple Force Friday. And then, well, this is really cool. I got this in the mail from a viewer, which it didn't say who it was. It's a little dusty, sorry. It was sitting on the floor for a couple minutes, and it grabbed up some dust downstairs. Uh, someone got me a 3D Dueler, which is it's the whole kit, and I haven't even opened it yet. 
um, it came to me through Amazon, and I was like trying to find out, you know, most probably I can find out who gave me it. But my other 3D Dueler, which is an original one, which I got from Kickstarter, which is way back, it died. Oh, most probably good three years ago it died, and I'm like, I'm not gonna get a 3D pen because I have the 3D printers. But on my on my thing, on my Arc Matter thing on my YouTube, it still says 3D Doodling. I've just never changed it because I've always liked my banner. So I'm like, oh, I don't like to leave my banner alone because I didn't want to mess with. Okay, I want to tell you the truth. I didn't want to mess with it because I, I don't under. <laughs> I get lost sometimes on editing my channel. There you have it. Gosh dang you people, drag it out of me. Quit twisting my arm. Uh, so I have a 3D dueler again, and it actually it's a whole thing. And I I gotta open it up and check it out. So whoever sent me this. Um, many thanks, because I have a 3D doodler now. <laughs> what does that mean? Does that mean I have to start doodling, 3D doodling again? But I have my printers, and I've been busy with them. I'm doing something for a company right now, actually. I'm printing uh, something pretty important, so that's all, another thing why I've been busy. And now I moved it, so now you get to see my stupid flat pillow thing there by Venom. Um, so let's real quick open the Star Wars... Um, tea thing and I think I've seen a photo of the different ones I'd love to get all of them but we'll start off with one and t-shirts I can hang up Funko because they're flat or I can fold them Funko <laughs> just kidding so there it's out of the little plastic wrap I gotta dump my trash back here and let's see we'll open it up from the bottom and I gotta get that. that sticker does come off pretty easy I did see this and I really did like I think I've seen the I really did like it. Uh, there's like no hiding of what it is. Uh, it is a Star Wars vintage looking. It and it's. I don't know, I it's Very impressive. Yeah. So it's Darth Vader, and I love that because it kind of brings back the old vinyl type. It's kind of like the old vinyl looking kind of Star Wars shirts that you got back in the 78, 79, 80 era time. There was like the little vinyl ones and those were pretty cool. I had, I think I, I think I had every one. And this thing is really cool. It's got a really nice look to it. And I like Funko's shirts because they're soft. So let's put this back up there. So there's that. And I think we're, I think we're gonna call it. I mean, thank you to the person out there that sent me the um, 3D Dueler. I love you, and I guess I'll start 3D dueling a little bit when I when I get the time. I will definitely do it, and I guess start watching a few videos, some of other people's videos, to get back into the uh, swing of it. And, okay. So I'm just pulling the sticker off this real quick. So then you peel the sticker off, then you got a, then you have a Star Wars looking um, VHS like you bought two. What? It's like you have two Star Wars movies, but it's not, not true. So there you have it. Please like, please subscribe, hit that bell if you want notification from me. And if you don't, well, I guess that's up to you. I don't force you to do anything. You just, you're my viewers. <laughs> and thanks for hanging out with me as usual. Have a great rest of the weekend, and I will catch up with you soon.